Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meat Shield and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Remake. This time we've got the full game. I've just finished uploading my unboxing video for the first class edition and it's time for me to sit down and dive back into a world that I have sorely missed. I mean, I could have sat down and played through the original at any time, but, you know, waiting for this has just been too good and the demo was just a fantastic teaser of what was to come. So, I'm going to sit down and play this from the start. I'm going to record through stuff. Um, I might just chop out the bombing mission side of things because we've all kind of already seen that, but I'm going to record it anyway in case I find anything new and we'll just get caught up to where we were, where we left off after the demo and see what lies ahead of us. This is a slightly different intro, isn't it? Certainly feels it. It's that Midgar off in the distance. Oh. Look at it. I say Midgard does just feel so more so much more alive. I remember, I feel like, I know I've seen this bit, was it in a trailer or did was this in like part of the, the demo? I don't remember. The whole thing is just stunning though. Oh, oh, oh yes. We go, go blow one of them up. Down to a quiet city street. Oh, I'm struggling really hard. I don't know if I'm going to be able to help myself. No, it's happening. It's happening. That brass is too good. Hands where I can see him. Have fun. Oh, I'm gonna. <laughs> well, one thing I've noticed so far is that a lot of these storage boxes seem to be giving me more stuff, which is pretty good if you ask me. Ooh, Phoenix down. Nice. What you got to say, Barrett? Security is only going to get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. Well, we haven't had any mistakes. We just keep running into people. And that's not our fault. Looks like the elevator's on another floor. Mind pushing that button? Yeah, I could boop the button. I'll push your buttons. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Oh. Oh, this is different. Look at Nibelheim. Oh. <laughs> Cloud! Are you ignoring me? Hmm? Tifa and I... <sighs> we didn't get that bit before. Move. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> okay, that was good. <laughs> Thanks, Barrett. Really needed that. <laughs> It wasn't until editing this bit in the demo that I had that I noticed Sephiroth's theme there. Didn't notice it when I first played it. What about the timer? Your call, Merc. Okay, let's go for 20 minutes again. Pretty cocky, ain't you? Oh, we're getting caught up with where we were. Oh, Jesse, come on. If I couldn't, believe me, you'd be the first to know. She would give me a stern telling to. Mm. <laughs> Leap. Nailed it. Okay, that was pretty cool. All right, come on. Is what he does. Oh yeah, we're gonna wait for that good explosion again. Come on, I want to hear it. Oh. There's some superb audio in this. Ooh, okay. Looks I think like we're we good. Yeah. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. Ooh. Might not be out of the woods yet. I think you might have overdone it. I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, Maybe. The city is still in one piece. But the plan is what matters, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, priorities, Baron. Duh. This must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Mm. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. You got it. Now, yeah, Wedge, show us where we're going. Watch Might. out for live wires. Oh. They're everywhere. Okay. Let's see if there's anything down this way. Ugh. The air in here reeks. Can't wait to get out in the yeah, open. Yeah, can't go back there. Right, come on. Let's get moving. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Ooh. Oh, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> that. And soon. Damn it, Biggs. You need a shower. I mean, after all of this excitement, you probably would be a bit sweaty. So, you know, just keep that in mind. Okay. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. Mm. We need to get out of this place. Yeah, you gotta worry about them aftershocks. The Marco density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. Oh, yeah. <sighs> well, keep you guessing. Empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next refuel. Time I'll have to bring a little pick me up. Well, it sounds like food time. Food time's a great time. Ooh, there's a box. Has that got food in? How much farther do we have to go? Not far. Well, it's got potions. Potions could technically be food. They have healing properties. Uh, oh, not That's that way. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Oh, not another one. <laughs> Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't oh. wait to take a hot shower. Yep. Wedge can't wait to get some food. Alright, we good to go. Hello. She's good to go. Oh, right, there we go. We shouldn't be standing this close, should we? Fire in the hole! I really don't think we should have been that close. That seems reckless and irresponsible, Jesse. Yeah. How's this door blown inwards? I don't know. Attention, all citizens. Ooh. Attention, all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor One. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fires. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. 
Oh, that seam. Damn. No, no way. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. <laughs> Merc's right. Mm. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. That's true. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your feelings. <laughs> Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh? Barra's getting good at these speeches. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! Now that's something I can get behind. That's motivating. <laughs> Let's go. I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Yeah, alright, okay, bye. <laughs> Off they fuck. What are we going here? Bottle of ether. Very nice. Up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it. Later then. Bye bye. Hey, I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. Well, yeah, I can't imagine Barrett would have been taking it with him on this rather dangerous mission. Honestly, Cloud. Here we go, we get to see the devastation at street level. Oh, oh bloody hell. What is it? Oh need to tell you what this is, right? It's materia. Of course not. It's healing materia. Cure! You can have it for saving my life. You're just doing my job. Nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. Oh bloody hell. Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. Uh, yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? Again, we're getting a tutorial anyway. Right, let's see how we're going to go about doing this. So, you can send materia to weapons and armor through materia and equipment. We press triangle to select to set the materia. So we have two slots on the Buster Sword. Uh, select an empty slot and then select the one that you want to use. Seems fine. Uh, thus ends the tutorial. Excellent. So ah, oh, these do have AP as they used to. So yeah, because I was wondering, you know, with the stars down on the right. Perfect. Exact same system. I can't complain about that. That is just fantastic. And obviously that applying it to your weapons and your armor or your, your trinkets or whatever you'd call them. Um, how can, I, can I check the gear? That'd be on cloud. Bronze bangle. There we are. Yeah, so any materia that gets added onto any equipment, be it weapons or armor, or anything like that along those lines or add to your attributes as well so it'll boost like attack defense strength vitality perfect they haven't changed that at all i love it okay i was only trying to help oh before i forget here's a little something extra for being so great that really was the ride of a lifetime well see you on the train and for a ride of a lifetime are we jesse god you really are one thirsty bitch uh, hello. No, you're not going to die. I need to get home. 
You know, you guys, you guys, like, do your thing. I'm, I'm gonna f go and find the train. Oh. thing you gotta f think what, what these people must have thought about all of this, because you never got this sort of scale of this event in the original. You can really see the people that are going to be affected by all this. Christ, look at the state of that thing. It is wrecked. Utterly wrecked. Cloud, up here. Look up. I said look up. Where? Oh. could collapse at any moment. If you want up, you'll have to use those stairs. That's where I was going, Jesse. Bloody hell. I just want to explore the place. I want to take in the atmosphere. I mean, the atmosphere is pretty fucking negative at the moment because, you know, massive part of the city just exploded. Okay, and more of it's actually happening as we speak. Ugh. Gas mains or interior mains or whatever. Just going off. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're down. Hope nobody was under that. Alright, don't mind me, I'm just the dude with the big sword. There's one in every town. There's one in every sector, actually. You know, you should travel more. Get out and about, see the world. Better than staying here. Oh, oh, fuck, Jesus, there were people under that. Oh, <laughs> that's not a good way to go. Fuck. Is that going to explode? Oh no, we're getting flashbacks. Oh, hello. Hey, pretty boy, how's it going? Oh, chills. Hi. What? Mm. Why are you here? Why now? Where are you going? I have questions. Am I going to follow him? Follow him. Oh, Jesus. Okay. I, w I wasn't expecting this at all. Oh, I like it though. The layering so much more. Because um, my housemate Dante and I were talking about this a little bit. The in the original, it was just kind of like it just kind of comes out of nowhere about Cloud's past. Yeah, you know, there's kind of like very small allusions to it, but this is really setting it up for so much more of a kind of greater involvement, I suppose. Bigger impact. Because I mean, who who doesn't know the fucking story at this point? I mean, granted, if you've never played the original or seen anything to do with it, fair enough, but. You know, I think for if you're even vaguely familiar with the game, it's kind of comparable to uh, like the you know Star Wars: Revenge of the Sith's big plot twist. You know, you're not real. You're. Uh, well, Revenge of the Sith. I mean, I, uh, Empire Strikes Back. What the fuck am I on about? Hi, how's it going? You with my own. <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together, but that was then. And this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our Do you? beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die. 
so many things would be lost. Your hometown burns so bright. The sound of her voice pleading for me to spare you. The shiver of her flesh yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I could make you stronger. <laughs> oh, that was... Oof. That was something else. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this. Yeah, you do. Okay. Oh, I recognize that theme. Was this a piece that was in the original game? Because I very much recognize it from Advent Children. I can't remember what piece it was, though. I can't remember what the name of it was. Mm. Right. Where are we going? Down more of the alleyways? Because, yeah, we ain't going down that way. Everything was fine, then. Big boom. Whoops. Our fault. My bad. Uh, excuse me. Uh, is there anything around? Where's that little pupper? I find it rather amusing that I can just kick everything over. Right. Further up and up and up we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is a hell of a mess. Oh, you can see Marco bursting through the pipes, kind of filtering through the pipes. I don't know. I don't get paid enough to think about that, madam. Sorry. Just go and ask Barrett. Yeah, that's kind of the thing, like these extreme actions. You know, affect those that work in those places. It, it hurts innocent people. You know, if you're, you're trying to, you know, save something or you're trying to strike against a big evil organization of, of whatever variety. Rash actions like this one. They, they affect the little people far more. They're the ones that will really suffer through it. But Shinra is going to brush this off, you know. Obviously, if they had their way, Shinra would completely brush this off and they'd be perfectly fine, but the people here on the ground, they're the ones that are going to hurt. Oh, there's soldiers, we don't want to go that way. Let's head this way instead. Is that a... Is that a flower girl? Ooh. Ooh. What was that? Okay. 
You are too weak to save anyone. <laughs> Not even yourself. Are you okay? Hey, are you okay? I don't know. <laughs> I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Thanks. A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. <laughs> I heard that, you know. How much? How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. <sighs> Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Sure you are. So? <laughs> no fucks given. <laughs> so keep your distance. Yeah, social distancing, hey, remember? You think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <laughs> Oh. All those things are back. You can show us what they are. Oh fuck, it's the Dementors. We're going to Azkaban, kids. Oh, nice. What are they? I do wonder what are they? Oh, hi. Drop your weapon! Kind of busy helping a girl deal with her problem with ghosts at the moment, if you don't mind, chaps. Mm. You know, you're right. Wait. Nice meeting you. Okay, bye. <laughs> you just take them with you. So, uh, guys, yeah. the ground. Right now. yeah, I don't think that's happening. Oh, come on, time to get wrecked. <laughs> we get as many of you fuckers as possible. Oh, yes! Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> oh, yes! Who the fuck exploded? Right, am I chasing you? Stuff around here, though. Uh, can I get through? No, I can't get through. The clown doesn't have the ability to jump. Okay, I think we got to go back this way then. Right. You guys need to get out of the way. I need to be protecting my flower. Thank you very much. Ooh. Right, grenadier, come here. Let's, uh, why not? I'll give you a big smack. Oh, ha! <laughs> yes, was never in doubt. Uh, ooh, what have I found? Is that materia? Orb of deadly dodge materia. <laughs> sure, why not? Okay. It's not clear, mate. <laughs> it's definitely not clear. Ooh. I'll whack and smack every single one of you. You doggos are real quick. Ow! Right, I'm trying to stagger you. Oh, yes, that will do it. Yeah, hey, doggo. Doggo! Get smacko! Yes! Yup! Oh, yes! 
not bad. Okay. So am I still trying to get to the train station? I'm assuming I am. I don't know which way I need to be going, though. Oh, never mind. I think this is it. Oh, yeah, we got more guards. More doggos. Oh, okay. You can't box me in. You can't put Howard Moon in a box. Okay, let's stagger that. Ah, oh, damn it, doggo. You sneaky bitch. Oh, shit. The fucking helicopter's after me as well. That's not on. Night night, doggo. Oh. You come here. We're gonna go braver and yep, definitely dead now. Good night, young sir. More troopers on standby. Oh, fuck it. okay. Hi. Oh, shock troopers. You guys are n annoying. You're bloody nimble. You keep dodging all my shit. Oh, shit, my health. And I don't have any... Right, there we go. I need to... Uh, high potion, that'll work. Uh, do I want operator mode? Probably not, because it's going to be way too slow. Right, let's... Ah, oh, there we go. Lovely. Oh, got him staggered. Oh, limit break. Yeah, let's do one of those. Cross slash. Let's fuck him up. Yep. Womp. Probably overkill, but I don't care. Dude. Fuck off. Yeah, try that. Get on it. Trying, trying to guard is, is really not working on that one. Okay, that works. Oh, yeah, get staggered, bitch. Right, I'm going to quickly use potion to heal up a bit. And then I'm just going to have to whack him. Now we can go braver. Yes! Don't let him escape! Oh, you can try. You got more troops coming in. Oh yeah, so we do. Grenadiers and troopers. You ain't no problem. Ain't no thing. Ow. Hi, how's it going? <laughs> Does your baton want to take on my massive sword? Don't mind me just going around swinging my big sword in public. Magic oh, farewell. Right, have you guys had enough now? Yeah? Okay, good. So much for the direct way. Yeah. Yeah, I can do that. I know there's a ladder. I've already seen it. I'm just having to look around to see if I can find some stuff. I found some stuff. Music just keeps teasing the fights. It's too good. Yeah, I know. But the rooftops look clear. Yes, they do. I mean, there are some changes to the music that I'm not overly fond of. Like, it does feel like it's kind of stepped away a little bit from so much of the iconic, um, you know, themes of the original. I do like what they've done with it. But sometimes listening to this, I'm just like, no, that, that's missing the next measure. Why are you shooting me up the arse, you cheeky boys? Fuck off. <laughs> you want to catch me, you're going to have to come up to the rooftops. Be advised, the area. Yeah, bloody hell. Is that necessary? Well, I suppose it probably is. Oh, I see him down there. 
Ooh, iron bangle. Do I change that over? Uh, interior and equipment. Um, okay, bronze bangle. Switch that out for iron. Yes. That means that I can now add materia to this one. I can add deadly dodge, which gives me more defense and vitality. Yes. Do I have any accessories? Power wrist guards? Hell yeah, I want power wrist guards on. They, they give me nothing. Oh no, increased strength by 5%. Sweet. So Cloud's fully stocked up on gear at the moment, which is great. But yeah, the way the music's kind of keeping that tension of the battle theme there. It keeps chucking in like little, uh, little measures from from it, giving it that little bit of flourish that feels familiar, and then it kicks right back in when you get into combat again. Oh god, we got a shieldy boy! I haven't thought about shield shieldy boys in a fucking long time. Not since the old. Uh... Wait, how am I meant to get around that? Oh, you f fuck off! I'm gonna be a womp. Ow, 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 sir! Do you mind? No, we're, we're gonna go punish her. No, um, operator mode, sorry. Come on then. Come on then. Yeah, I don't think so, mate. Come at me. You ready for this? <laughs> I don't think you are. Get wrecked, gotta get round behind you. You're done, son. Yeah. Really need to heal, though. <laughs> Do that a couple of times, that's good. Makes me feel better. You don't see shit. Oh, for God's sake. Right, okay, come in. You wanna, you wanna go? Where are you gonna fucking go? Don't blame me if you get hurt and have to. Your, your spouse has to worry about your life insurance plan. I'm just trying to catch a train. Those look like train tracks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, f yeah, I'll bet I am. I obtained a Moogle medal. How wonderful for me. Oh, hello. Hiding behind jeeps now, or cars or whatever. How would you know if I'm a bastard or not? I don't even know if my parents were married before I was born. Ow. 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 Alright, let's try, um, something like this. Womp! Uh, ow, you cheeky dick! Uh, uh alright, okay. We, if we're gonna be trying to get me stun-locked on shit, that's not on. Alright. Focus thrust, get him. Fucking blocks, you cheeky wankers. Hello, Cloud. Get in there. Fuck up their shit. Right, deal with this guy first, because he's not shielded. He's just a problem child. Oh, yes! That's how we do it. Oh, for God's sake, there's always more. Yes, he is. Hi, how's it going? Nice to see you. Cloud, you're, you're trying to swing your sword the wrong way, mate. Uh, there we go. Getting easier to deal with. I want to see if there's anything up here. You're probably missing out on goodies. See, I, I fucking knew it. 
Somebody better pick up that phone because I fucking called it. Bottle of ether. Very nice. I'll drink that when I get home. I'm just taking this kid's bike with me as well, so don't mind me. <laughs> and we're back around here. Can I get up this side as well? Yeah, I can. There's another bike to trample. <laughs> I would say why are people just leaving their bikes out in the street, but when something explodes, you probably just want to run away from it. That being said, why would you leave the bike? The bike would get you home faster. Yeah. But why am I trying to apply logic to this? I do not want to surrender myself to public security. Oh, fucking doggos. Come on, come on, come on. I need to uh, focus thrust on the doggo. I'm going to stagger. Yep. I'm going to smack. Goodbye, doggo. Okay. Ow. Got clobbered. So did you. Ho ho. Off you go. Why is it the dogs are more durable than a bloke with a shield? <laughs> right. oh. Staggered and braver, get him. Yeah! Nice. Some more boxes over here. Let's grab some stuff. Sweet. Fucking hell. I mean, there's loads of stuff to go about trying to find, which is just fantastic. And the box. Containing... High Potion. Can't argue with that. Right. Oh, there we go. Sorry, fucked up your bike again. Another bike. Oh, so many bikes. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> End of the line, uh, I suppose it is, isn't it? Are you? Oh... Shieldy boys. Hmm. Are we, Cloud? Are we really doing? We're really doing this. Okay. Shut up. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh, that was just fantastic. Right. Yeah, these are the guys that I really wanted to be going for. I thought it would have been better to go for Riot Boy. Oh, it feels like this, the battle theme's really got back to its old school roots now. So, yes. Right. You first, get out of it. Right. Oh, this guy's called the Huntsman. He must be a tough one. Oh, I think he is. I need to heal. Shit. Fall back. Boom, boom, boom. There it is. That's, that's just what I wanted to hear from this thing. Oh, I feel at home. Yes. Oh, I love it. I, I'm so happy with this. Come on, come on. Come on, you. Get your ass out of here. Expose yourself! <laughs> oh, yes! Right, get back around behind him and let's do that again. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. Ow! <laughs> My pretty little face. How could you? Oh, fuck it. Ow! Oh, shit. Stunned me. Oh, I can't help myself. I'm having such a fun time. All it took was the music. If I get an opportunity to limit break your ass, I am fucking doing it. Come here. Alright, okay, let's get that focus thrust and see if we can stagger him or pressure him. Right, that works. 
Go for that. Yeah. Oh, nice. That really laid it in heavy. I'm going to take an opportunity to... Oh, I need to build up some more ATB. Shite. That'll do it. Ow. <laughs> I wanted to heal myself anyway, so yeah, thanks for giving me some distance. Oh, got him staggered. Fucking yes. Come on. Lay it in. Lay it in. Breather. Go. Fuck yes. You ain't securing shit. Wait. I know that. You know that what? Here we go. I'm gonna catch a train. Yes. Later, dickheads. <laughs> One guy who was just like, ah. Kiss Cloud won't be joining us after all. Knock knock. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? Hmm. Huh? Huh? <laughs> How's it going? Uh, you had me worried for a minute. Huh? Huh? Uh, <laughs> what the hell you been up to? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Giving public security the runaround? That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> oh, forever grumps, aren't you? <laughs> Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. <laughs> yeah, let's. People here. Because of the evacuation order. That was fun. Lucky us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train and hold there. Okay, let's do that. An emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Oh, good. I'm glad of that. Let's explore this train. Hello, people. Why would Wudai be involved? They're on the other side of the world. Anything around here to bloody help? Wait. Oh, there is a box. Nice. Sorry, sorry. Don't, don't mind getting stabbed by my massive sword as I bend over. Me. I know, right? Oh, it means you got a seat. Man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. <laughs> hey, Cloud. Are you the one who grabbed my sleeve? If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Yeesh. <laughs> you don't make it easy. Stop that right now. Wait, where is it? Okay. Is everybody getting... No, I don't know. Wait. It was... Sorry, madam. Hey, got a sec? Sure. You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Well, my hands are still shaking. You get yet. used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. I'd probably say not. You know, I suppose... Now lives in Sector 8, so it's probably got a bit of a blessing and a bit of a curse, but, you know... Excuse me, people. Don't mind me. Just coming through. Maybe a little help, Cloud? Please? What's that? I can't stop thinking about it. Stupid. 
The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. I want to keep your voice down. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail safes to prevent that kind of thing? It should. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. No. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Mm. I try. Right, excuse me, gents. Ah, Barrett. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? Hello. <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Oh. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking out your ass. <laughs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? J just who do you think you are? Not somebody in middle but middle management. Biden concerns. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Law-abiding? <laughs> really? <laughs> uh, uh, shh! Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? <laughs> We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that is the Shinra Creed. Yep, yep, just get clapping. <laughs> Them spiting words. <laughs> it's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? True. We should go. Right. <laughs> I've got your umbrella. <laughs> oh, Barrett, you're no good at making friends here, are you? Yeah, I think so. Can I, can I, Cloud, can we turn around and look at Barrett, please? Thank you. You hear that suit? Shouldn't recreate my ass. I suppose. Uh, Somebody's already on the nap. Nice one. All right, what's going down? Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. Okay. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not. <laughs> There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. <laughs> so here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, mm -hmm. complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. Well, that's good. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. I've got Won't faith. Be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Got it in my heart. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there... Don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Uh, 
Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. Rooted to its tracks. Chapter 3, Home Sweet Slum. step closer to a brighter future. Again, you guys yeah. probably should be celebrating on the platform. Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Thank you. That's what I've been saying this entire fucking train journey. Get some R &R. You've earned it. <laughs> Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at 7th Heaven. You know, where Tifa works? Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. Oh, we'll be there soon enough. But man, ah. Oh. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy to be here. It's great to be back. Midgard just feels alive and thriving. Also partially devastated, but, <laughs> oh God. Detail in everything is just stunning. I'm really excited to keep, get myself stuck into more of this. But I'm going to wrap this episode up here for now. And I'm going to try and pace myself with recording these videos. But I have a feeling I may be recording more of this before the day's out. Whoops. <laughs> so I hope we're all looking forward to playing through this. I hope you guys at home who've got the game... Uh, thoroughly enjoying it. I know I am already. Honestly, it just took that battle theme to finally hit its mark. That It was just that that really made, really sold this for me and I'm just like, yes. I feel, I feel good. And I can't wait to see more. So, depending on how like the, the kind of pacing of the chapters go, we may try and do a chapter or video or something like that. I don't know. I'll see how we get on. But for now, I am going to wrap this episode up here, and I am going to say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays of Metal Covers, and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, subscribe on YouTube, chuck me a follow over on Twitch, or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. I can't stop fucking smiling. Ah, it's just, it's just too good. But thank you again for watching this video, and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off. Fucking Jesus! Ow!